everybody. Terry here. I'm just gonna work on my one page in my journal for a little bit. So I'm working on January of this year. I don't have this page totally decided how I'm going to do it. So I think I'm gonna put that sticky note that I got from Stationery Pal on here and then this picture on top of that like that and then I want to put an envelope here I wrote a letter to my dad about what he's missing what he has missed since he died he died on the 18th of December in 1998 and he was buried on the 21st I believe of December so needless, needless to say that was a hard Christmas so anyway I just wrote a letter to him just about the, all the things that he missed since he's died. He missed meeting his youngest grandchild. Uh, Logan was born five months after he died. So of course he missed all his great grandchildren, uh, which is 11. I, uh, he missed all kinds of technology. He loved technology and there's so much new innovative technology out there he would have loved that and then of course I mentioned the pandemic and I mentioned what all the great all the grandchildren are doing and how my mom is doing so I think I'm gonna put the envelope there so this here is I had a doily a paper doily and so I thought oh, I'm gonna stencil that so it's not perfect, but I like it. So I think I'm gonna put the envelope here and then decorate it. And then I wanna get another picture. This is my dad when he was in the, the US Army back in the 50s. So he was probably around 19 there, 20 maybe. I wanna put get another picture of when he was older and maybe one of him holding me or with me when I was growing up. So that's what I'm gonna do here. I'm positive I want the envelope there. Okay, so I want it to make sure it's straight. I'm terrible at getting things straight, cutting things straight. See, it's not 100% straight and I don't know if I can rip it off without wrecking the paper. If I had to save my life by cutting a straight line, I would be dead. Oh, that's too far down. So I think I will leave this here. I want to add some sayings to this because my dad had several sayings. Okay, so I might trim the sides off a little bit. I gotta get my cutter. One of his sayings was like, ready means having your coat and shoes on and being at the door. Okay. And if you'd say, everybody's doing it, he'd say, everybody, everybody's doing it, everybody. Okay. I don't know why this picture is pink. I never saw it before till this year. My cousin put it online. There. And that's just the way it came. Out of the printer. So this is the 14th of January, which would have been his birthday. All right, so that is all I'm doing t tonight or right now because I want to get another picture. I want to decorate this. So I will either show it to you as I'm working on it. 
again or when it's done. This is his sister, my aunt that lived in Dearborn, Michigan, that died this year. So this is the finished page. This is the envelope that has the letter in it. I put a, a book page and a pile of books here that I got from Stationery Pal because my dad was an avid reader. He loved reading, especially if it had to do with history. And that's my mom and dad. The envelope decorated a little bit. And then the letter is in there. And I put, put a picture of my mom and dad at my aunt's wedding. My mom was a bridesmaid for my aunt here. So that is my completed page. I hope you like it. Okay, so I will talk to you later, guys. Bye now.